All right, good morning. Good morning. Let's go. Oh, it's starting to drizzle. Good morning, Elliot. Where are we going? Auto. Auto, yeah. And where are we going to go in the car? Adika. <laughs> Smart boy. Okay, so we're going to Adika. Whoop. Okay, you're opening the gate. All right, shut the gate. Well, that's not mommy's car. Come this way. Ellie, it's over here. Where's mommy's car? Where is it? make him look for the car. Do you see mommy's car? Yeah. Where is it? Yeah. <gasps> Let's check. Yeah. Sure is. All right. Good job. Good morning. You don't remember this, Elliot, because you weren't around. But for a long time, people with the vlog, Calvin and I used to go to Attica quite a bit. And then, um, I don't have very many memories of Linnea as a baby baby in Germany because we lived I'm in the UK. Baby. You're the baby? Yeah. You're the baby? Yeah. You are mama's baby. I'm my baby. You're mama's baby? I'm my baby. My baby? Yeah? Is your ear bothering you? Yeah. Yeah? You might have to get that same surgery that Callum got. He doesn't have an ear infection or anything, but he has issues with um, his ear draining, which is what Callum had. Are you ready to go? Yeah. So hi-ho, hi-ho, off to Ada Cub we go. Okay, this way, sweetie. Turn. What a helper. You want to push? Can you push? You want up? Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Whee! Elliot, say hi. 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 Okay. Oh, here are the cheeses. You want to come get your cheese? Let go. There you go. Super. That's what Calm likes to take in his lunch in his little breakfast box. All right, can you put them in? Wow, what a big helper. You wanna come back up? Yeah. Beep, 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 beep. Next stop on the Hogwarts Express. Whoop, <laughs> there you go. Oh, there goes my list too. When you're a mom with a toddler, just expect lots of time in here. Okay, are we pushing now? No. You want up? No. Okay, you want to push yourself. Let's see how that goes. All right, let's go this way. Ellie, come pick out your pizza. I think for dinner tonight, we're going to do frozen pizzas with some cut vegetables because I'm exhausted. Which one would you like? All right, the kids are home. We just had dinner and they are getting ready. Yep, so he's gonna deliver birthday invitations to his friends. Here's Elliot's helmet. Come here, Belly. <laughs> so cute. It's so interesting. This is a very modern building right here. And then right across you have an older building. This is so Berlin. We're done with the deliveries. Done with the deliveries, that's right. 
You did great. All right, we're going home. Good morning. Where's Ellie? Where's Elliot? Where? Boo, there he is. <laughs> All right, good morning everybody. I am doing a bunch of housework today, tackling clothes, laundry that needs to be folded, gonna vacuum, put up stuff. Mama. Have you cleaned up your puzzles? Have you cleaned? No. Why are you saying, why are you telling me do? Mm -hmm. Have you cleaned up your puzzles? No. <laughs> All right, bye. Okay, so you want your tunnel? Yeah. <laughs> well, good job, good for you. Do you wanna play with that while I do laundry? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, okay, bye. Hello, Elliot. I'm looking at Elliot. Hi, sweet boy. Is he still sleeping? No, he's awake, okay. So, good morning, everybody. I hope you're doing well. Elliot and I are at the mall. I try not to buy a bunch of stuff because we don't need stuff. And also, you know, we're like saving for a house. But I saw that H&M has this whole range of like France, Paris themed shirts and sweatshirts. And I just felt so happy, like such a happiness that I haven't felt in so long, <laughs> which is kind of crazy. Generally, I feel quite good about things, but it just brought such joy, like such immense joy. You ready to go in? Yeah. Okay. So then let's do this. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it looks brutal, doesn't it? Oh, gosh. Yeah, Falkenstein. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody is perfect. success at H&M today. I ended up getting... Oh, gosh, that's a commercial. What's this, Tess?
Good morning, everybody. It's Friday. I'm wearing one of my new sweatshirts that I got yesterday from H&M. Um, my whole France love continues. There are just certain things that feed your soul. And for me, I don't know if it's because like I grew up in New Orleans and obviously there's, there's a strong, very, very strong, heavy French influence in Louisiana in general. But, you know, in New Orleans, it's uh, very, very, very prevalent. I just really feel like every time I see something French, it just kind of makes me feel a little at home. And um, my spoken French, my verbal French is absolutely horrid, but um, I do understand some and I, I try. <laughs> I learn, I, I, I try to practice, but it's like, it's hard to practice when you aren't there. But anyways, Elliot and I have playgroup this morning, so I'm going to get him off to playgroup. Bye. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Ah. Uh, Hi. Ah. Uh, Elliot. Ah. <laughs> uh -huh. Hi. How are you? Ah. Uh, how was your nap? Ah. Uh, uh, You're such a little, little goober. You just, ay, ay, you, ay, 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 ay. What's that? Boo. Boo. It's the weekend and the kids are home. And the sky is not great for the first time in several days, so we are outside. It's so nice to be outside. We have been inside so much lately because it's been rainy and just really gross. All right, so it's Friday night. We had our chicken dinos. The kids want to watch Pokemon. What are you playing with? The train? Elliot's got his train track out. And these two are watching their show. Roman, I'm tired. Me too. I don't think the kids are tired though. Roman, what should we do tomorrow? Well, the kids are costume. Yeah. So the kids are having a foshing party just with other kids in the building. Um, that's on Sunday. Oh, because now Calm's on break. He's got his winter break, so he's out of school for a week. Huh? Who all is gone? Uh... You always know. No, I don't know. The kids are going to get a little costume, so we're gonna go do that, and then also probably finalize some birthday stuff. Yeah, so Calm's got his birthday in a couple of weeks. So does Elliot, and um, as of right now, we are having a small party for Callum. He has invited five, five boys from his class. It's really crazy that we're going to have an eight-year-old soon. I, Callum's birthday always really gets to me because I always think, I mean, with him being my first, he's the one that I became a mom with. And eight years ago, eight years ago, I was going to all my final OB appointments and just eagerly awaiting to meet this little boy that would ultimately just sort of change change our lives forever. So I'm really excited. I, I always get, it's, it's very bittersweet to me, very bittersweet to just think about him growing up and, you know, every year he grows up, it feels like we get older. And of course, I mean, of course, but I think with his birthday, I just really feel it because he's, you know, the one that made me a mom. And I think, gosh, I've been a mom for eight years. That's, that's crazy. We threw a party for him last year um, with the kids in the building and that was really fun. But he hasn't had a party where he's been able to really invite friends from school. 
since his party in London and we did a big party for him for his first for his fifth birthday. The next year when he turned six, I I was very pregnant with Elliot and ended up delivering Elliot the day before we kind of like mentally planned on having a party for Callum. So I was in the hospital on the day that we were going to have a birthday party for Callum. He had he did indeed, you know, have like cupcakes and things at his at his kindergarten and my mother-in-law came for his birthday and that so that that was really nice he enjoyed that and then um a couple days later he had a little brother so it, it it was it was crazy and then last year was his pokemon birthday party in the pandemic with the kids in the building so this year we've been really kind of weird like what do we do um didn't want to make it a super big thing in terms of like inviting lots of people because obviously we are still in a pandemic but okay so he invited five boys of those five boys four of them just recovered from omicron um it's still quite a bit to plan so and then knowing we've got elliot's birthday a couple days later and the kids really like celebrating his birthday and um they like when I do decorations and stuff for his birthday too. And it's just, it's it's gonna be good, but busy. And we're starting to uh, lose the time. Now we're starting to get closer. So I really need to, really need to get going with some of these projects. So yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna end the vlog. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.